you go to file then go to new you come to legacy title click on legacy title you wait for some seconds to come up now you will go to you type tools click on it click on it on the uh, on the space given to you then you press ctrl v now you see it come up with uh, what you have copied from the software So you click out, then you come to this place, you come here, so you place it in the middle, then you pull it down, you pull it down, then you will change the uh, font, you will change the font, and if you are okay with the font, then you can leave it, so you make sure you reduce the size. You do this is size after you have changed the font you can reduce it to 40 or 45 so i'm reducing it to 45 let me use 45 so this is 45 and you you arrange it very well so you make use of this uh line so after that then you make sure you save you save thank you for watching so after saving it you, you you can come here also you don't need to go and open from file again you will come to this uh, edge a new title base on current title so that is you can still open another uh, title base on and again and again so you come here you see the number increase then you press ok you go again to copy ctrl v or you highlight it and copy it so you copy then you come here you come to adobe Premiere pro again you double click on it you can press ctrl a to highlight it yeah then press ctrl uh, v to paste it so then you can click on this uh, center alignment to balance it after that then you come to uh, center alignment again to balance it also then you click out then you save now after you have copied every down turn from the uh, or the translation then you close and you come to your uh, already edited uh, uh, movie then you the first one you you start from the first uh, you, you start from where you copy you start from the first scene then you drag it to the timeline as you can see now you now make sure you go by their uh, dialogue by their words so make sure you centralize it at the right now let's play it Let's assume that is the right uh, translation. So you have already translated subtitle. Yeah. So that is it. The next one, you make sure you place it where the dialogue starts. Starts. So, all right. Okay, so 
that is it so that is how you place all the translation into your timeline or you what you have copy here that's how you will place it on your timeline on, on top of the footage already 